Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Rising World on the Radio Man 03. It is awesome to have you along. I am streaming on Twitch TV at the Radio Man 03 right now. It's 3 o'clock in the afternoon in Arizona. 90 degrees outside my house right now. 90 degrees. Doesn't get to 90 degrees very often. It's hot. I left 106 degrees today and it was something else. I'll tell you what, it was something else. Um, <laughs> it was warm. Very warm. Is there any way I could just take... Oh, we'll just take those with us. We're going to take that with us. We're going to take that with us. Uh, we don't need that, 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 that. We're going to take these with us. These with us. Those with us. There we go. Hope everyone's doing great. I'm doing pretty good. Pretty darn good. Um, I want to go back down into the dungeon today to see what it is we missed. I said we were going to do that last episode, but I wanted to get something out about the JIW games and the changes that are coming to the game. Uh, so that's what we did. Uh, resources, no, uh, crafting, inventory, crafting, medical, there we go, leg splint. Oh, I need four bandages for that. So uh, I want to go back down into the dungeon on this episode. Oh, real quick before we do, uh, turn my light on for you. Up here, I have finished the roof, the ceiling. I don't... Uh, there was some suggestions for some cross beams, and we may still do some cross beams up here. Uh, it's going to bring the ceiling kind of down low to us, but I've got this set up now, and this is our room, of course, back here for our bedroom uh, area, and then this is all kind of cleaned up now and looking better. These blocks will probably come out. I'm not too fond of it now that they're there, and we've got some other blocks that we've added to it. I'm not too thrilled about how they look, so we'll, we'll see what we do there. Uh, what do we need for going down into the dungeon? We've got the battle axe, we've got the hammer. Do I have my drill with me? I want the pick. I want a pick as well. Um, let's shut the house up for the day. Uh, I'm guessing I left it in the house. I'm guessing. This is going to be the last stream for a little bit. Uh, my new guy, hopefully, hopefully, keep your fingers crossed for me. This is week seven of me working by myself. Ace, are you okay? Okay, you're walking, okay. Um, this is my week seven working by myself. Now, the longest you normally do that is a week or two for people that are on vacation. But this is week seven, so I'm getting pretty tired of being by myself. Uh, it's a lot of work to do. Uh, I want to bring a pick with and oh there's more bandages right there fantastic okay now where is my drill oh you know what i think i left the drill down in the mine i'm pretty sure that's what i did i'm gonna take this with me we're gonna take this we're gonna put this on boom just like that armor is gonna be a, a must and anything else in there that i think i need i don't think so i think i'm good to go uh, ooh, we got a second water skin, though. We could fill that up, take that with us. Well, I was going to take a bucket of water, right? Let's leave that here. Where's my bucket of water at? Oh, there it is right there. Beautiful. Okay, so a bucket of water. Uh, that way we could just throw it on the ground and drink from it. And let's go to crafting. Let's get a leg splint made. All right, inventory. And we've got ourselves a wonderful leg splint. We're going to take... Uh, what is it? Shift... Control click. Oh, now I can't remember. I cannot remember how to take just one. I know there was a way to do this. Is it alt? Alt click? Control, left click, right click, shift, right, left, right. Shift drag. No, okay. I'm not remembering how to do that. I'm sure you guys will tell me. And the drill is downstairs. Uh, anyways, back to what I was talking about. Yeah, we've got, um, I've, I've got my, hopefully this guy's going to come tomorrow. Young guy from California, fresh out of college a couple of years ago, looking for his first media job, and um, he applied to our ad. He's been kind of a sports guy up until now, and um, I need somebody who's going to write news and do some recording and things like that for me is what I need somebody to do. There's our drill right there. Like a boss. Do we have any torch mounts or anything like that in here? No, we don't. I feel like the apples are going to be good for me. Oh, God. Maybe I should take some kind of other food with me. Maybe. 
So he's going to come by Wednesday, the 17th of July, to take a look and see if this is what he wants to do. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is what he wants to do. And um, I'm going to take those with me as well. I know my inventory is getting all clogged up with stuff already. We're going to be finding stuff. But if I have to, I can leave some things behind. That's okay. And if he likes it... Hello, Fox. Ah! <laughs> if he likes it, we got to get him here fast. I go on vacation early September, like the first week of September, uh, or just to start the second week of September. So if we don't have somebody, there's nobody to do what I do um, at all. So we got to get on the fast track. Now, we've had since May to get this going. And I told my boss, I said, you know, it's going to be here fast. It gets here fast. So we, we should really get going on it now. And he's like, oh, we've got time. It's not till September. Well, here we are, uh, mid-July. Uh, all we have is August to train somebody. And it's going to take it's gonna take me about two weeks to do all the training. And then, hello, Gold Dragon. It's going to take me about two weeks to do the training. That's dry, making the long drive every day for two weeks. Uh, and it's the hottest time of the year, too. So I'm just, you know, I'm pretty wiped out when I get home. I'm wiped out today, but uh, I wanted to make sure I got on here and at least let you guys know, those of you who watch the stream and show up for it, that uh, we'll, we'll resume streaming games uh, when I get things situated, get this person up to speed, probably get back from vacation and everything's kind of mellowed out again, and then we'll jump back into something like that. But... Um, this is just kind of an offshoot, just kind of a fun thing I've been doing for a little bit, just to see how it goes. And um, um, so there's that. There's that thing going on. Uh, there's our first cave that we ran into. Uh, I'm not pleased with how the stream footage is looking on YouTube. That's This is the second thing, though. So um, I'm not real pleased with how this game shows on the stream. It looks really good. But then when it comes time to... Uh, put it on YouTube, it's very blurry. E even with uh, the higher bit rate and stuff, it's been very blurry. So I'm not real pleased with that. So I, I don't feel like that's very fair. I've got, you know, 6, 7, 14 people that watch the stream uh, when I'm on. But then, you know, I'm not... The video itself doesn't look good. And I don't like that. So I don't know what to do about it. I'm not a technical kind of person. Oh, I should probably check my back. I thought I, I, I know I heard a hiss. I did. Take it, spider. So when we get all back to normal and I get things going, we'll 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 figure out what we're gonna do. Uh, that does not mean I'm not going to record Rising World, though. We'll still I'll still have episodes of Rising World because yesterday, uh, which was Monday, I did a record of it, and the record came out. Really, I was pretty pleased with the recording. Let's turn the light off and see. Do we have a torch anywhere showing up? Um, hmm. Let's walk a little bit. Oh, I need a light. I'm, I'm not walking down here in the dark. There's just no way I'm doing that. I'm going to kind of put some torches up uh, where they need to be. Okay, so we need one right here for sure. There we go. We'll add a few more of these. What was I saying? Hello, Jason. Oh, I can't remember what I was saying now. I'm sure it's about work or this or, or that. Uh, light off. Okay, so I don't see any light either direction there. So I'm going to say that we're probably going to have to go back this way maybe. Let's take a look over here and see. I did not put up enough torches last time, for sure. Okay, there's some sulfur left over that I dug out. Okay, here we go. So here, let's put another one right here. We should be good to find our way all the way down, I would think. Spiders didn't respawn, unless I missed that one. Okay, we came up through here. Uh, you guys think it's that way? I see the torch here, of course. I'm just wondering if... Well, let's... Let's keep going this way. Since we have a torch here. Aha! Uh 
Aha, uh -huh, there we go. Okay, fantastic. Oh, there's some iron right over here too. Let's uh, let's not grab the iron just yet. Let's not do that. Um, if I turn my light off, we could use another torch and torch mount right here, I think. And we're going to have to make a few more of those. It's okay because we brought a little bit of wood with us. That's great. Uh, lights. Wooden torch mount. Torches. There we go. Beautiful. All right, let's keep going. The depths of the, the pit. The pit of doom. Okay, here we go. Right down this way. All right, beautiful. Oh, oh, oh. I hear you. I hear you, spider. I know I'm not going the right way, guys. I know. Oh, there he is. There he is right there. Oh, I missed! Oh, ho, 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 he showed me! How dare you try to squish me. More sulfur. Awesome. Let's put a torch mount here, too, just so we've got this sulfur. We'll come back and grab that. Nice. Oh, there's mithril, too. Ooh, ooh, and more sulfur. Oh, my God. There's a bunch. Look at it. It's right over there, too. There's a whole bunch of it down in here. All right. Um, yeah, let's, we'll leave that right there. We'll, we'll explore this a little bit later. I'm kind of curious to get back to that dungeon because it was a big one. I want to see just, whoa, whoa, whoa. I want to see just what it has in it. I, I can't imagine I walked up this, did I? Is this a walkable thing? It looks really bad. <laughs> this looks really awful. Maybe I did make it up this. Looks like I did some drilling here. Maybe I did. I guess I did. All right. I uh, probably could come down that way. A little bit easier. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and do, instead of that, I think this probably loops around up to it. Let's make sure it does, and then we will take that route instead. Yeah, it does. Okay, so... Yeah, there's a dead spider from last... No, this is where we were just at. Okay. Alright, skirt the wall. Come on down. Alright, so this is where we don't have enough torches again. I'm sure there's going to be one here visible to us hopefully soon. Uh-huh. Okay, so we've got one down there. Okay, but how is... What's the best way to get down there? Let's see. We've got torch light right there. I'm willing to bet this probably goes down into that area. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, there's our first dungeon. That's our first dungeon. So let's put a torch right here. And as we walk up... We'll bump into that one there, but let's go ahead and put another one right here just, just to be on the safe side. There we go. Beautiful. Perfect. Okay, that was our small one, right? This is the small one that we found, and then we went deeper, and we found a second one. And then there was a third one that we were digging around, but it didn't really have, like, uh, a door, it seemed like, to get into it. There we go. Uh, oh, there's some coal. There's some deliciousness coal right there. I'll put another one right here. Nice. Beautiful. Pamphy, hello. Uh, if you're asking if I'm if I'm going to keep recording Rising World, I am going to keep ri recording Rising World. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I considered not because they're going to do the new engine thing, but I thought, you know, I was talking to Variety about it, and she still says, no, you got to keep doing it. And I was like, you know what? You're right. I do need to keep doing. Don't, don't stop doing Rising World just because they're going to have this new engine, until they have the new engine out. Keep, keep going. Let's see. Come here, buddy. Hee hee hoo! Take it with the drill, Buster Brown. Ha ha ha! Oh my God! Oh, the drill is a great weapon. I think this is the one we were in already, huh? Yeah, we were in here already. We, we cleared this one out. Looks like they respawned, which is great to see. I like that idea. You know, there's new undead down here doing uh, the undead deeds. 
Let's close that door. Get out of here. The drill. The ultimate weapon. <laughs> okay, so where was the other one at? There it is, right here. Okay, so here it is. Uh, we did not find a door to this big one. We busted in through a side wall last time. Are you guys good with that? And we'll see if we can find the door out of this thing. It may be right up here. This looks like the floor, uh, like we were just walking on. So maybe it's right over here. Let's drill a little bit and we'll see. I was talking about recording. Uh, yeah, just that I'm going to keep recording this game. I considered stopping and waiting for the new engine to come out, but that yeah, doesn't make any sense to do that. We'll just, we'll just keep supporting GIW games and showing what they've got right here, and then when the new engine comes out, we'll jump right on that and have a great time with it, I think. Did you guys go and look at the, uh, the pictures? All eight of you here? Did you guys look at those pictures on the Steam page? I'm going to keep moving forward while you guys uh, talk about that. We'll look at it. Okay, I was told that I could take these. I've never done this before, but I could take that, and I could take this, and the torch will just dangle there. Ugh, that looks weird. My ears are all plugged up. I go from 7,000 feet down to 3,000 feet. What, is he blind? Gargle on that, Buster Brown. Take it, you lousy skeleton. <laughs> I can't get enough of that. This looks like a dungeon room to me. Possibly? Oh, I feel dirty about taking these and leaving those floating torches there. It ain't right, people. It ain't right. Ooh, look at all the doors in here. Oh my gosh, door galore. <gasps> oh, hey you! Take it to the back of the head, you dumb, you dumb skeleton. <laughs> okay, so we've got braziers. Ooh, we got the rack. Oh, very nice. Oh, let's close this door behind us. Let's uh, let's get a little drink of water. Let's take care of ourselves. We've got a little bit of damage here. Eat the apple. There we go. That, 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 that fixes the health up pretty good. Take a little chug a lug there. Water. There we go. Inventory. And you can see we're at 199% there. According to that, that's very good. Let's do that right there. I think if we take our time and just do this right, we'll be okay. It's going to be all right. Uh, yeah. Okay. All right. So this is awesome. Come with me. Hopefully you guys stack. I have never... Oh, they do. I have never found these in a dungeon, these things right here. Looks like we got the rack for stretching. And what's she called? She's got the spikes in her, right? Let's take a look and see. I want those for the house. Uh, I really don't want the skull. I've got several of these. I don't need that. Uh, Q. 
There we go. The torture rack. Does this is this operational? Can I do anything with this? Doesn't look like it. Nevertheless. Oh, for, for a second I thought I was going to be able to pick it up again. All right, inventory. There's the rack. Ho, ho, ho. Like it. Oh, there's a cage here too. Oh, very cool. Oh. Iron Maiden. There you go. I think you're right about that. I think you're right. I think it's the Iron Maiden. Okay, so I'm tired of having things go up in there. Let's throw some food up in there. Oh, you can open it too. Look at that. That is fantastic. I love that. That's how that's got to be displayed. You know, I'd be willing to stick myself in there and close the door and see how much damage we take when we get back. <laughs> just, just because I'm curious about it, just to see if it really works. Oh, there's, oh my gosh, look at this up here, too. There's more up on the ceiling. Do I need all of them? Uh, inventory. I've got the hammer this t I got the hammer with me. Okay, so now let's grab these guys right here. And we're going to go up this way. reach it yet bingo nice oh, what an awesome room keep a few blocks on us for now too just in case we need to do this again which looks to me like we might have to yeah first time first dungeon ever I will uh, show you the coordinates too in case you're interested uh, here we go I'll hit F3 right after I get down from this little this little perch right here. It's right below our house. Just a little further down from where we were before. Um, F3. We are at uh, negative 1298, negative 47623, 30485. Not too shabby. Can I bust these two? Yep, yeah, sure. Can. Oh, they turn into dust. Drill, drill, drill. Come here, you. Oh, that one's cool. Look at that skeleton. He has no armor on. <laughs> I let him hit me. I felt bad for him. He's got no clothes on, for Pete's sake. So, two. That is the first skeleton I've seen with no armor on. That was pretty awesome. Uh, yes, and the rest of it can stay here. Don't need it. All right, that takes care of this part of the dungeon. That is an incredibly awesome room. That was fun. Okay, let's go check the other one now. Okay, we're going to leave that door open, and let's leave that door open. That's going to tell me that I was in there, I hope. That's what it tells me. And we got to go down. And, oh, this loops around here, too. What we got in here? Pelvis... Femur, skull, that's about it. All right. Let's grab this here. Check in the chat real quick. Hey, you, Yahoo. How you doing? How you doing? Thanks for coming by again. Appreciate it. Oh, oh, what is this? <gasps> Ooh. That was pretty cool. Come on. Be careful. Get my back turned. Bam. The drill. The best weapon in the game. <laughs> now I'll be curious. Oh!
Ooh. He was faring pretty well with that armor on, wasn't he? Hello, hello, hello. Is anybody here? Here, here. <laughs> oh, there's none of those. Ah, oh, there's not one of those there. That's too bad. Um, what do you call it? Um, eh, gold ore. We've got all the weapons and stuff, so. You know, eventually, when JIW Games gets gets everything back on track again, um, I'm hoping there's going to be a lot of really amazing things added to the game down the road. It would really be cool if we could take this stuff and display it in a weapons rack, like on Skyrim. Okay, so this goes up. Let's go take a look and see if this goes any... There's like a door that leads out of here, maybe? Ooh. Oh, wow. Look at this. Oh, maybe this is attached to the other dungeon. This is... Have you guys ever seen a staircase as tall as this one? Oh. Oh. It's just, uh... It's just a chest up here. Uh... Silver. Okay. I got the katana. Morning star. There's the hammer. Yeah, we've got all these things up here. We've got all that stuff, so we're good. Be able to sell it, display it. You know, something. We'll have to see what happens in the future, right? The potential is just so much that I really hope they can get it going. And, and I, I was happy to see that in his uh, his update that they, he does have somebody else now that's helping him uh, develop this new engine, which is really good news. So I'm wishing him the best of luck on it. Okay, he's holding a sword. He don't matter. Oh, there's another door that's blocked by stone. Hey. What's going on there, skelly boy? I'm going to get turned around in here, and I'm going to get lost. Maybe this is the way out? Uh-huh. This is a massive dungeon. Ooh, look at all that sulfur. Dang, man, this place is crawling with it. What, about 450 to 470? We're running into a lot, a lot of it. I like that. Come on, give it to me. Give me that torch mount. We want these in our, our mine and our house and stuff. They're nice. You guys are going to help me find my way out of here and... Find the other stuff that we're missing. There he is. Well, he, he got around, huh? Oh boy, here we go. I'm getting turned around. Okay, I've been through here. Because that's been sprung. Hey, mister. They're going to have to have better aggro distance, too, in the future. Come on. Okay, so that that is the dungeon we were just in, right? Doors open and everything. Okay, so he moved around quite a bit. I think this is right. Yeah, this is the one we were in. Okay. False door. Is there anything behind this here? Okay, we went down. Yeah, we got the torches off of that, so we cleared that one. We went up the stairs. There was nothing up there. Oh my god. I should really cover these holes up with some stone. Whatever. This was our exit, I believe. Yep. 
Yeah, what's the exit? Let's go down this way a little bit and just see if there's anything else down here. Does this just kind of dead end or can we find any of our torches that we put up before? A lot of curiosity. More sulfur. Wow. Holy cow, that just keeps on going. This has been a pretty good find. Uh, oh. Do you think this is part of our dungeon that we're in right now? I think it might be. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that is. And there, there's more sulfur on the wall there. Let's grab this really quick. I just don't feel like I'm going to be... Oh, there's iron too. Dang it. I hope things get more expensive too. Inventory. Tools wear out. All that good stuff. Yeah, this is great. A little bit of iron ore. Nice. Okay, good deal. We needed this really bad. We still need a bunch. We're going to be using it uh, to make lighting for the house and stuff. These uh, torch mounts that we're picking up, I think well, these would look really nice in the walkway with the torches in them. Oh, man, it just keeps on giving. And this is the big hole we saw, right? Yeah, okay. So up here and to the right. This floor is nice and flat right here. The floor of the cave. Uh, we'll grab this guy right here. Uh, oh my god, look at this. Let's just grab it up. Uh, it looks like it's a pretty thin layer of it. Sulfur and gold mixed together, is that right? Okay, there's a blocked doorway right there. I think we got it. We went up the stairs. I've cleared that area out already there, too. Oh, we've not been there because I've got the trap on the floor there. Okay, so let's, uh, well, let's check this. Let's check this stone over here. Oh, boy. Here it is right here. Let's check this first. Just go anywhere, lead any anything. Okay, I see. We've been here. Okay. Oh, give me some stone on my hot bar. Let's let's go ahead and do this real quick, if we can. Just to keep me from falling in there. In case we got to run or something. There we go. If you don't do, to do don't know how to do that, just just drag have the stone in your hotbar and just drag it around. Page up, page down will give you a few more options with the stone and gravel and things like that too. Okay, so there's the, there's the other chest. Okay, we're going to cover this one up too. Is 
and then take it out of your hand so you can see what you're doing. Just as easy to do this right here. Come on. I have fallen in those before. It's a pain in the butt getting out of that stuff. There we go, and let's just go ahead and do this too. Tearing it up. Gold bars, gold crown, all that good stuff there. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. That's going to be the other torch mounts. We're not really interested in those. Uh, I'm going to leave that one there. It's just not worth screwing around in here. So if you fall in, you've got the parkour thing to come out on. And it's tiny stuff to be jumping on. I panic when I fall on those things. <laughs> and it scares me. Uh, this was the way we got in right here because I remember the floor has got that missing piece. I think, do you think guys think we've got this now? I think we have it. Manta Rock. Uh, we've got most of the wall sconces. Most of them we do have in our inventory. Check your chat right now. we got 23 of those. Check it out. We've got cages. Uh, oh, they only stacked two. We have the Torture Rack, the Iron Maiden. Very good, Iron Maiden. I hadn't noticed that when we picked it up, but there we go, the Iron Maiden. And we have some of these, uh, a Vase Torch. I guess it's not really a brazier, is it? The brazier would have been the one that was in that room that had uh, the four pillars in the middle of it. That would have been the brazier. Uh, I'm going to have to take a little chug-a-lug, chug-a-lug here. All right, let's, let's try this out, too. Let's see. We're down here. I've got no water in my water skin anymore, right? It's gone. If I come back here and take this water, there we go, like that, and go to my inventory, take my water skin. Hope you guys can see that water there. Can I fill it up with this? Okay, I filled my bottle. All right, now let's get the bucket back. Can I pick this back up? Bam. Thirsty no more. You got your water. You got your water in a ninja suit. What else do you need? A helmet with a light would be good. Indeed. I think we got it. What do you think? We've been through there. We know we tore that up. That staircase just goes up to a chest. We did that. I think we've got it. That goes out. That goes out to the cave, which I don't want to do that. We've already got a way in and out of here. I think, I think we've accomplished our task of coming down into this dungeon and seeing what there is to see. Yeah, this is our way out. Oh man, that was fantastic. I love that. Drill. Come on. And we're out. Completely. Wait a minute, wait a minute. This isn't the right way. Is this the right way? No, this is not the right way. Let's keep walking around this thing. Come on. Here we go. Alright, the way out. Now, do we leave anything behind in these other dungeons here? We were in this one a little bit. It was the big one that we didn't go into. This one, we saw somebody there. Can I drill doors? We can. Uh, okay, we don't want those sconces. We want the big ones. Let's see if we left any of them down in here. I think I grabbed them all. Uh, back to some stone in our inventory here real quick. Uh, let's take the 19. go and that should be good I 
Okay, no. A lot of the stuff I just don't need because we already have it, you know. I am going to take the black bow. I'm not sure if we have that. I am going to take that just because I'm unsure about that. And I had some of those. I threw them in here, so we'll take those back too. Since we were here and we, you know, dropped them. So that was it. Yeah, these other two dungeons were pretty tiny, but that one, man, that's a, that's a good one. I like that. Okay, so we did that. Uh, I guess we go... This was the other dungeon, correct? Yeah, that's the dungeon with the wall. That's our way out. Let's go down here and see if there's anything down this way. <gasps> oh, oh. Oh, this is a big room. I feel like we're getting to the point where we are really close to hell here. Because, you know what? We got this now. Can't see him anymore. Because we're running into these bigger rooms like this. This is the huge cave entrance. Oh, that was so close. Oh my god, I'm just right over his head. I don't know if you guys can even see that. Got him. Nailed him. He's dead. Yeah, this is... There's no way we're here. This is like... The armpit of hell right here. F3? Negative 530? There's no way this should be it, right? It's all gold. Yes, yeah, gold. I don't even know what I need gold for. It doesn't really mean much. I guess you've got to make another drill, huh? You need it for the drill and stuff. So I guess it's important, but um, wow, this is really cool down here. Is this gold as well? If this is gold, I don't need to grab it. Yeah, that's gold. That's likely gold up there, too. So... This is not hell. Hell is further down. We're, like, still, like, a, a few hundred blocks high for that, I think. Right? Oh, z I can zoom in. Okay, z for zooming when I'm shooting, too, huh? Oh, one standing two. Okay, that's why the uh, these aren't stacking. Cage. Hanging. Oh, I see. Okay, you're right. We've got two different kinds. Okay. Never found those before. So th this this is this would be a good place to start to dig to hell for sure. Um, at this level here at 530, negative 530, we wouldn't have very far to go at all. I'm not going to drill to hell today. But now that we know, it's right next to... This room is right next to... You know, it's just... Come on. There we go. I don't like your dentiness. Okay, so we are going up to get out of here. So you can shoot while you're zoomed. Let me let me try that real quick. Just hold down Z. Oh. Oh, look at that. That is nice. I've never done that before. Okay. Awesome. That is a good little tip right there. Okay, let's uh let's be let's be careful about this as we climb out of this dangerous place. There we go. Uh, still going up. 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 And away. 
in my beautiful balloon. <laughs> what a dork. What a dork. So I've got Variety. Variety and I. Okay. All right. We got Star Wars fans out there. Hello, Bit Dragon. Uh, oh, yes. Mithril. Yeah, we grabbed a bunch of Mithril. Matter of fact, we found some more Mithril while we were down here. I didn't dig it up, but we've got some torches. I think we're, we're going to walk by it here in a little bit, maybe. I'm so good at marking my path. So, Variety was never a big Star Wars fan. Me, I've got my action figures from when I was a kid from the late 70s, early 80s. I still have them. Matter of fact, they're in a little case sitting right next to me here. And, um... We're going to uh, Disneyland um, in September to go see the Galaxy's Edge uh, thing opened up. Let's go over here and take a look. I think that Mithril's over here, maybe. Well, she's not super into the Star Wars thing. But, of course, I am a dork. Yeah, Mithril right here. Right here. I'll show you the uh, F3 here. That's the coordinates, and we are at uh, negative 403, so right around negative 400, it looks like, is where this stuff kind of comes into play. Oh, that's just a tease. Oh, did I even get any? I got one, yeah. We, we picked up, I don't know, 30 or more uh, in the last, the last go-round. We found a nice pocket of it, actually. So... So I've been, we've been watching all the movies and trying to get them in order all the way across the board. So we started out, you know, with the old ones, not the old ones, but trying to watch them in order that they would have taken place. And uh, she's been getting into it, which is nice. We're on the very last one that we can watch now. Uh, what is it? Uh, I wasn't too impressed with the newest ones. I feel like the remakes of the old ones. Uh, the ones with Ray and Finn and those characters. They just kind of feel like the old movies to me. Like remakes. But nevertheless, uh, Variety's been watching them and she's enjoying it. So, you know, last night we were watching... Um, oh, God. Han Solo's son, Ben. Um, Kylo Ren. Sticks his saber right through him. And, what did he just do? Right? Like, Wait a minute. What the heck? And that's like, oh yeah, 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 yeah. He kills his father. Yeah, he's real. He's a real lovely person. Anyway, she was, and then the next movie, Princess Leia, gets blown out of the ship, and uh, into space, and she kind of you know glides herself back into the ship and stuff. And so, Bridie's like, is anybody gonna live? <laughs> so, it's been kind of fun to watch all of them. We're gonna finish that up tonight while we're having dinner and stuff. And I get to go to bed because I got to get up at a stupid hour in the morning. 2.50 a.m. Who gets up at 2.50 a.m. anyways? Who does something like that? Some of you chose the wrong path. <laughs> you have chosen poorly. Ooh, let's, uh, I hope you guys don't mind. I'm going to check out some of these little side tunnels here, too, to see if we've got any uh, uh, surface ores that we can grab a hold of. We, but this is actually a... It's a booming cave, man. This thing is amazingly awesome inside. I really have, have had a fun time uh, digging around here with you guys. That's for sure. Okay, there's my light up there. Let's take a look down this way. Boy, the headlamp is a must, is it not? Uh, okay, so we were here. We dug that hole right there. Okay, we dug that hole. Very good. Um, Variety does need to get the force. She's getting the force. She's getting it. She's excited about going. I'm going to be like a kid in a candy store. There was an action figure I had when I was a kid, the Gamorrean Guard. The uh, If you're not familiar with it, if you've ever watched Return of the Jedi, the, the pig. That uh, is in Jabba the Hutt's palace. That is his, like, his guard. Um, I had that figure. And for the life of me, I have no idea what happened to him. And he's like one of my favorite figures. So I'm hoping I can find something, someone, something to replace it. I hope, I hope, I hope. Come on. You can do it. Come on. You got the power in those legs. Do it. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Ooh, 
last time I was there. Um, give me one second here. Hold on. Just show you how big of a dork, dork I am. Last time I was there, we, we like to go, we, what we do is we go to Disneyland in the morning, right? We go on a few rides and stuff like that. And then around noon, when everybody starts getting grumpy and the kids need to take naps and stuff like that, we go to downtown Disney and we'll, we'll sit outside in their, their bars and stuff and have drinks and everything and eat and, you know, just kind of hang out. Well, we went shopping one time and uh, we'd had some drinks. As you wish, put Captain Solo in the cargo hold. What if he doesn't survive? <laughs> it's Boba Fett. <laughs> so I bought a big Boba Fett. You push his little chest button and he talks. He's my friend. He sits here next to me. Actually, he's not. He's in a cabinet. Giovanni's in here now. He's like, what are you doing? I'm being a nerd, G. Leave me alone. Oh. Oh, I tell you, you don't need nothing but the drill. Nothing but the drill. I'm wondering if I could kill some of these animals with this thing. Uh-oh. Aha, there we go. Phantom Menace, Attack of the Clones, Revenge of the Sith, Solo, Rogue One, New Hope. We watched Solo and Rogue One uh, in the wrong order because what I was confused about is how is Darth Maul in Solo, but he got killed in um, The Phantom Menace, but I didn't realize that he's actually not dead. They He's got a robotic body later on, so... We did watch those again, and she's seen both of those as well. All right, and then what else do you have here? Empire, yeah, New Hope, Empire Strikes Back. Yeah, Return of the Jedi, Force Awakens, Last Jedi, Rise of Skywalker. Yeah, Rise of Skywalker is the one we have. We don't have that one. Well, Rise of Skywalker, is that even out yet, or is that later on this year? Cole. Hold on a second real quick. Let's, uh... Oh, I've got room for stone. If we could pick up more stone up. I'm not going to pass this up. We're going to need this for cooking and stuff. So this is great. Two coal. Lovely. Take a look here at the chat real fast. Or can I not the younger? Okay. I, I'm if I'm not mistaken, I think Disney kind of stopped production on a lot of the Star Wars stuff. I think they thought people Solo did not do well. I I liked it. I I thought it was pretty good. I thought it was interesting on how he uh, got his last name and. Uh, you know, the Millennium Falcon. I thought in Solo, the guy who played Lando Calrissian was uh, spectacular. I think he did a tremendous job <clears throat> of portraying Lando Calrissian. I was just like, wow, this guy is just really good at this. Uh, he had the mannerisms, the movements, the sound, all of that was really, really well done, I thought. Uh, in, the, in that movie, Solo, I thought he was the best character in there. I was really impressed with uh, his ability. Did a good job. Of course, these are my opinions. Doesn't mean anybody has to agree with me or not, but I liked him. Okay, Rise of Skywalker. I thought so. Okay, it's at the end of the year, huh? Yeah. Okay. We made it out, people. Look at us. Look at us. We are true dungeon diving sons of guns. We did it. We got the loot, we got the goodness, we got to set it up somewhere and take a look at it, and, and I've got to see it again. <clears throat> We're going to get us a cow, put it on that rack, stretch it out. <laughs> oh my god. The cow. He's no good to me dead. He's no good to me dead. The longest ladder in the world.
yeah, I agree with the, the guy who played Young Solo also. And I'm wondering if it's because they, they were just kind of cramming them out. <clears throat> I think maybe that has part of it as well, is that just, you know, the old Star Wars movies were always just kind of, oh my God, you know, there's a new Star And then it was like, oh wow, it's like this treat. There's this movie coming out for Star Wars. And it was like this, oh yeah. And then, you know, all the time, it, it almost like, oh, there's another one coming. Hmm, okay. Um, I always liked him. I like him. I'm a nerd for sure. I love it. Okay, look at this, guys. Look at this loot. Dang, man. There's there's some gold. There's some silver. There's some coal. Uh, let's throw that up there. That's nice. That's a nice amount of coal right there. Iron. We're up to... I need to move some of this stuff around. Let's get a little bit organized here while we're sitting here. Oh, you know what I should do is take the tools... And put them in number two. And then we don't have to think about that. There we go. Uh, iron to... Oh, wow. Okay, for somebody who didn't have any iron, we're doing pretty good on it now, aren't we? Okay, there's some gold. Uh, copper. Silver. Here's our, here's our mithril. That's more gold. Aluminum. Oh, that's aluminum. Okay, so... Or aluminum, however you happen to say it. Mithril. Okay, and then we've got some silver. Some more silver. We got silver for days. be so cool if we could sell that stuff. Uh, there's another five of those. And we've got stone, and then just the fun things we found while we were down there. Uh, yeah, what time is it? It's either 3 o'clock in the afternoon, or no, 2 o'clock. Or it is 2 a.m. <laughs> One of the two. Let's go see. Did I have these guys all these torch mounts? I do. See, I've got the good torch mounts in here for us so that they look really nice. When they hold the torches. This is what I want on our, um... No, please. It never does this. I want them out here too, instead of these wood ones. I want them out here. I think they'll look nice. What do you know about that? It looks like it's the afternoon, indeed. <coughs> oh, my goodness. Mithril coated drain. Let's, uh, let's take the stuff out here. Stone. horrible weather day those of you who weren't here for the early part of the stream we do have um, the ceiling put in here now so I got that taken care of today I had to take off uh, this side all the way down all the way again I had that mostly done uh, because this juts out one from the wall and then goes up and that side didn't so it wasn't coming out very good up at the top there so I had to change that around but we did it uh, okay, so stone. And we'll throw those in there too. There's some more stone. That's great. So we got a little bit of stone to work with. <clears throat> I don't know how much more stone work we actually have in the house, but uh, we've got a little bit to, to play with. That's nice. Okay, I told myself I was going to stick myself in that thing and see what happens. I feel like I should do that. Uh, arrow key. Oh my god, look at her. She's amazing. I love that. Oh, tell me she doesn't look perfect right there. Oh my god. The whole house could be a trophy room. Hold down right click. Alright, we'll get in there in just a second. I'm pretty sure I should sleep. I should sleep before I do something like that, huh? That could, that could be a really stupid move. I'm pretty sure I've not slept anywhere other than in that bed. And then if you didn't know, didn't, if you guys weren't here for this either, we've got this as well. <laughs> the rack. This will go in here. This will go in this room over here eventually. Can I place this on the side of the wall? No. We still don't have all the pieces though, do we? Does this hurt if you walk on it? No. And again, we, we tried this, right? And you can't do anything with that. 
It doesn't prompt me to do anything with it. Chains. There's something we need, huh? We need we need chains so we can make things that hang from chains. Metal bars and things like that too would be really cool. Okay, so what else do we have that we want to get out of our inventory? Just about everything, I think. Uh, oh, I want to show one of these guys to you, in case you don't know what this is. This could be something else that we could put right down here. We could do one of these. Right up here against the wall. Uh, I'm going to make sure. Uh, well, it, it, isn't it, uh, if I hold down... Yeah, if I hold down left click, that allows you to walk up and take a look around at it without it moving and stuff. And then all you have to do is hold down right click at the same time then, and it'll place it. Oh, man, she looks awesome right there. Okay, that's, that's, is she, her head's not in the ceiling, is in the, in, embedded there, is it? Nope, nope, it's not. Okay, all right, let's put the rest of this stuff away. That, that, everything, everything, everything's got to go. Uh, we'll eat a few apples just to, uh, well, we don't need to do that. Oh, there's the cages, too. You get, if, let me know if you haven't seen the cages. I'll look at the chat. We can, we can do the cages, too. All right. Uh, oh, close. Da -da 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 -da. Some music, please. There we go. All right. Let's jump in. Oh. What? Can't get in. And you can't... Oh. Oh, yeah. I can't get in. Can I, can I turn sideways to get in here? No. No. It's like there's something that stops me right here. It's almost like this completely goes curves around. Yeah, I can't get in there. So you got a free nude shot just because. <laughs> you do. Well, that's too bad. That's really too bad. What am I doing? I need you. Throw the, we can leave all that in there. I'm going to throw that in there, that in there. Uh, we don't need that. We don't need that. We don't need that, really. So let's take a look at these guys again. We have a standing one and a hanging one. So the standing one looks like so. And then the hanging one... That's really cool. How uncomfortable would that be to be sitting in? You would spill your guts for sure. Let me tell you everything you want to know. Please let me out of this cage. Okay, do I have everything I need here? Uh, food. Okay, we'll just throw that back in there. Food. Extra food there. A bucket of water can stay right there. Here's our health stuff, just in case. And we're good to go there. All right, let's go get uh, let's go get our clothes back. Get to death cold out here. I was kind of hoping I could get in there and just to see what kind of damage, how fast the damage would occur, but. You know, as we always say, maybe someday, maybe someday we'll be able to do that. Uh, we want that, that, that. There we go. Bam. Just like that. We're set. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. That was fun. I had a great time. I hope you enjoyed uh, going down to the dungeons again and, and checking it for the, uh, the torture chamber. I believe that's not all the items available in a torture chamber. I've, I've got to think there's 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 more. And I'm sure you guys will let me know what else is in those, those dungeons for the torture chambers. But 
We did pretty good with this one. I've got uh, several things I have never, ever had before. Things I've never found are all right here. None of this stuff is I ever have I ever found. Well, I've had these before, but not the maiden, not this cage, not this cage, and certainly not uh, the stretch rack either. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the stream. If you did, hit that like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share on the Radio Man 03. Have an awesome, fantastic, and a superb day. And I look forward to talking to you guys again next time.